Hey folks, welcome back to Stranded Alien Dawn. Pretty much right where we left off last episode, Umayar is just getting back with the meat, and, and uh, Simon and Carter are just going to bed. They just arrived. Um, I thought they were going to bring it to the drying rack, but turns out the space that still has the little room left is already finished drying, so that one is pretty much invalid. So, it's all going into the freezer as fresh meat, which is a problem in that we know it's not going to stay frozen or maybe even not stay refrigerated with the heat of the summer. So, I think for a temporary measure, what I might do is take these last... Uh, wooden walls and make them brick and maybe even make the roof brick now that we've got the ability to reconstruct now I the challenge is going to be getting this wall right here but that the door is built into because it doesn't show it to me I've been before I started the episode kind of swinging the camera around trying to make it build the wall and you can't make those walls build you go to roofed and you can kind of see them then you can get access to it but when you click on it it goes to the room and then it takes the roof off and you still can't get to it so that's a bit of a challenge i think i'm going to try that four walls reconstruct you to brick and let's do the roof you guys right there and wooden roof five reconstruct you to brick okay that's going i've got edmund working on that other hot air balloon otherwise rita is up and she is going to go fill up dog's bowl and that's enough food to uh, feed him for a long long time so i'm gonna take her back off of ranch move it to a two so she can concentrate on planting and harvesting still. Um, Edmund, when you're done, what kind of condition are you in? You could use a meal. So why don't you pop over and reconstruct, reconstruct, eat buttermelon pie. Why don't you do that one? I, yeah, you're still finishing. In fact, we'll watch that finish. Buttermelon pie, good. Huh? That threw 50 veggie leather onto the ground. I don't know what to make of that, but thanks. <laughs> and then I want you to do what's been I've been waiting to get done. Take this guy down. Um, I can't do something like rebuild you as something else. I can't. Okay. So Edmund, you take this down. And I want to put a single arch in there since... The archway takes away our ability to use the walls over here, pretty much anything else. I'll uh, have to live with a single arch, and it won't be the big wide open look I, like I want, but at least it'll be more functional. Edmund, I'll kind of hang around for you to do that. Kana is tailoring, which is good. We are going to be low on... That's right, we're going to be low on uh, shirts and whatnot, and we can't do anything with that because there is no cotton available we're still growing it we do have the feathers out there somewhere so we can go get that and convert that to cloth Edmund yeah you did do it now hang on wherever you went don't go away uh, single arch copy you drop you in there Edmund build that and make that happen okay otherwise Edmund's looking pretty good his happiness is forecast all the way out to there um be nice to get this done i do want us to go up to the bug nests and get carbon nanotubes figured out and started so we can rebuild this once again in something that's even more insulative the wood is medium the brick is i guess good and the carbon nanotube is, tube is great if you want to put it in those terms so we do need that to happen, but we still got toxic ash fallout going on, which is kind of annoying. And setting them off long distance is not wise. As you can see, all the reds showing up on Rita right here. Who is doing what? Oh, she is off to go do what Paulette didn't the other day, including grabbing the five. Yeah, good. 
Good. She'll bring all those back. Old equipment and rotted away. We can get rid of these guys. We know that our clothes are rotting. And we're going to fix that soon. In fact, Simon is teleport or transporting what he just made. Okay, we have plenty of slop for a while. So let's, let's cut the slop. <laughs> All right, slop, we're going to take you down to like 300. Yeah, 200. We don't need to go through all those berries like we did before. Limit is reached, so you can stop. So you can work on what right now? Not enough resources for a crossbow. We don't need one at the moment. Okay. Um, what does that mean? Oh, alloys. In fact, let's make alloys happen. You are... Make alloys from scrap. Let's move that up and do that one time. And I'm curious about something. So bricks up to 300. From ore forever, whenever we do get, go get some ore. And concrete, um, let's take this guy up to 100. So until, actually probably 200. Well, it's going to deplete our stone. We'll just have to keep up on the stone. But I want to set this guy, and then I want you to select another device to mirror its list. So I want you to mirror this one. And now this one is going to do the one time from scrap, the 300, the 200, and the forever. Hey, it works. You mirror that one. You mirror that one. And you mirror that one. So you set one furnace and then make them all the same. I like it. All right, so we're going to do one more round of alloy from scrap. So there's 50 more coming, so we can work on some of these other projects. Um, Kana, I'm thinking let's add a second Taylor's bench. Uh, copy over here. And that way we can get two people making clothes when we finally get the cotton coming in. Simon, it'd be nice if you went to go get the feathers. You get the faster run speed. Carter is handling a fermentation barrel. Um, making what? Antibiotics until we get to 50. Let's take you down to 40. Maybe 50 is a bit aggressive and never seem to get to anything else. That's making wine. Uh, can I make wine, Carter? Can. Why don't you do that instead? You get grapes over there, okay. And pickled vegetables. How are we doing vegetable-wise? I'm looking for pumpkins. They're probably in the freezers. And I did take the grain out of the freezers. They were really refrigerators. They were really kind of plugging it up, though I have to remember it doesn't really mean anything anymore. It's just storage. Um, am I seeing... Pumpkins, there we are, 630, and break them down. They are good for another 50-some days. Uh, this is probably the worst one? No. Worst one looks like right here, 32%. So I wish I knew what that was. 32% of another 54 days? Something like that? So a third of it? Um, let's do some pickled. So let's then... Did I set this one? I don't think I did. Let's do that one, and uh, we don't have the ability to make... Well, our limit is reached on fuel. <laughs> Let's do some more pickles. Okay, right there. Actually, we could do wines, just because I have a feeling blueberries are going to be popping here soon and become abundant. Um, Simon, you are... Is that you? There you are. You're dropping that off. And you're going to go make some more leather. How about you come out here. Let's see if I can even find those other feathers that Paulette never got to. So they're not that far out. They're over here. There's 40. Right there. Oh, that's a new 40. So where do these come from? Are these where these guys die? That might be it. When these guys are killed, they leave feathers behind. I wonder if we hunted them. If we would get feathers. Hmm. What are you? Oh, okay. You're a 
what do you guys call it? A humming fly? Yeah. Okay, so we got feathers over there. Let me get my bearings again. Where are we? We're over here. So Paulette didn't get to some feathers that were, I thought, kind of out in here, but I'm not seeing them on my list anymore. I know we got a pile sitting right here. So there's feathers, but there were more feathers somewhere. Did they rot away? Maybe they did. There's 40 in here. That's the 40 that that uh, are kind of new. So is it over here? Nope, just those. Okay. We could try for that. Simon, why don't you grab these? Where did that go? Right in there. Hall. And... You the same ones? No, there's more. Where are you guys at? Oh, there's two piles sitting here. That's what was so confusing. Okay. So, Simon, go and get these. Let's just make sure we got that right. Yeah, you're already doing it. Okay. You get those, you'll grab the other ones. And on your way back, maybe I can get you to pick up these as well. Though it might be faster just to send someone else out here to do it. Let's just do that. So Edmund is constructing. I need Edmund to be cutting trees too. Carter's handling. Kana is tailoring. Paulette is handling. Paulette, I was going to say, even though there is toxic ash, there is no more toxic ash. Oh, good. And Paulette, why don't you finish the job that you never really finished before? There's only 20% life left in these okay so paulette is hauling we now have bread good um which means we need to process those as fast as we can get them all right so let's remember to do that today uh carter liked bread i remember that yeah and somebody else did umiar does and his he could actually use a meal right now. Um, in fact, he's already figured it out. <laughs> okay. Uh, Paulette is busy, though. Go and collect the feathers. I want to keep bread up at the top, which it basically is. Okay. And let's kick that up a bit. We'll do six of them instead. All right, so that's all happening. would like to get some more mining in, but as far as ore, but let's go ahead and use up some of our scrap metal. It's more convenient. Carter is working on so many things. Um, Umar is eating, then he's going to do some some uh, scrap metal into alloy. We'll let him do all these things after he gets a meal. Okay, I see we have fuel just sitting out here, and it's not going to rot too quickly, so I guess it's not that big a deal. Dog, how are you doing? Your happiness is at 80. You're not liking the slop, but you are enjoying all of the being petted and in good health. So we'll say you're good enough for now. Um, otherwise, what is truly happening? Umar, how did you do as far as rest? You came back. I don't think you even went to sleep last night. No, you did. Good. You did get a good night's sleep. You came in at dawn um Edmund constructing floor now for me it's been many days since I recorded I'm trying to remember when our last attack was was that recently or it was not because we had toxic ash all last episode and I kept waiting for the the attack to hit at the end of it which had been the pattern for all the other times we had toxic ash and it didn't happen okay so we have an attack coming soon which means i'm not going to send anybody out just yet and if it leaves us alone long enough early tomorrow morning i'd like to go take out that nest so let's maybe plan on that so we'll just let today run out paulette's transporting so as soon as she gets back simon you are transporting 120 you found 40 more great we're going to have cotton tomorrow <laughs> So, Umiar is transporting the bricks that were made in here. 
Carter is transporting the wine he just made. And Edmund has been faithfully building these last two bedrooms without Carter's help. Because he apparently has deliver or transport a little bit higher than Edmund does. So you are blocked. Hey. Eh? Something to do with this? Could be. Carter, you're in between. Let's assign you to actually get these done. Oh. Well, what that wall is blocked because they can't get to it. Because of the stove and the fridge. Hmm. Let's do a little manipulating here. How do we move these guys around? Plus, I also wanted a, an entryway into this little hallway. Ah, should these have been on that wall instead? But the door's over there. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. Move you. If I do that, can I get you facing him right here? Uh, move is M? It is. And rotate. It looks like it'll let me. Okay. You guys do that. Carter, can you move you guys? Uh, do that now. And then can you get in and work on these? Four walls. And I guess yeah, you're doing decent. Let's throw in the roof. Yeah. Okay. We'll watch that happen today. So handling a furnace, you were blocked from doing something. I'm seeing the bricks on the floor here, which kind of tells me something went wrong. Like Carter tried to work on it and gave up, or Edmund. Don't know. But you're putting the stoves over there. That's good. Now you are reconstructing. How will I know if... Oh, I guess he's doing it now. So the wall that the door is on is being done. Remember in RimWorld, whenever they work on a door, and they, if anybody walked through it, they would just quit their job and go find something else to do? That was annoying. <laughs> Looks like he was able to handle it here, though. Okay, so the walls are done, and we're now a brick-enclosed freezer. And now he's going to go work on the roof. Mm, I guess we're not going to see it immediately. So, Carter, all the other roofs are... Do all of them. Okay, so put that in there. You probably brought the bricks for everything, though. Hopefully I got that right. It looks like I do. They're highlighted in blue. So we're not going to get into here. Uh, more poo rotted away. <laughs> Cramped room... Negative nine. So, cramped room, huh? Because the room is filled with so much stuff and this stuff's on the floor? Where are you actually at, Carter? Do you see a Carter? Because I don't. I see your name. There you are. So you don't like being back here. Hmm. Well, let's get somebody to clean this room up. Edmund... Rita's eating, although I really don't want to bother Rita. In fact, I really want Rita to... Uh, what is your next plan? I want to get this planted up. You are harvesting these. Do we have any of the sweet syrups in stock? We have a thousand sweet syrups in stock. Okay, so Rita, your stats are good. Come out here and plant uh, grain grass as fast as you can. And Umayar is handling all the furnaces. And he'll get frustrated if I tell him to, if I change his schedule yet again. Simon, you're on your way in. Simon's stats are, if he just had a meal, he could start processing cotton out of feathers. So let's grab him a bread or bush fruits and veggie soup and grain porridge. What do we need to get rid of first? Veggie soups. So, Simon, can you next eat a veggie soup? And I want, and then, hmm, then put these away. Haul, haul, and haul. And 
then I want you to start processing cotton as fast as you can. Let's put that into here. Do we have it yet? Um, my cotton out of feathers or feathers into cotton or something like that. Don't see you. So drop you into here. You down there, cloth feathers, until, oh, 200. And say yes, and bring you to the top. There's not something we're going to do very often, so it can be up on top and not worry about it taking over everything we do. We're not going to be collecting feathers very often. It's just a backup plan because it's a long walk to go get it. All right, so you will Simon eating. Feathers went where? There they are, 160. So you should head over here. Clean up this mess. And then hopefully, well, I might have to tell you to do the feathers. We'll see. It is number one on your first crafting, your closest crafting table. So you should drop right into transporting bread. So transporting is ahead of. New apparel, leather vest. Okay, oh, that's right. We've got some of the uh, leather armor mixed into this now. And you are getting that. Oh, you're loading up the stoves. All right, let's just have you come straight over and get this done. Simon, make me a whole bunch of cloth. Thank you. Paula can load up her own stove. Carter's handling a cook stove. So I'm going to have to get Carter one notch closer to construction, apparently. Let's do that. Let's get you constructing more than other things. Be nice to get this built. What else? Um, yeah, you'll figure it out. Um, Umayar, where are you right now? You're still working on stoves. You are researching. Back in Kana's bedroom, because we haven't built the new research desk yet. What are you researching right now? First aid kit. So you're just kind of cleaning up all the, the old stuff. Okay. Um, what is next? So if I didn't do a next, what would you default to? Will you get back to observing? Be nice to get bushes and trees observed. Uh, Umiar, no, your observe is all the way up to a five. Wow, oh, because you don't like going outside. You just go out there when I need a body and yours is the only one available so I throw you out there okay so observing really it comes down to Edmund or Simon yeah uh, actually Simon is in better form now than Edmund Edmund hasn't been maintaining his his uh, his research skills okay I'm just noticing this bush right here it's just waiting to finish being observed but I don't want to pull Simon off of that but once that's available, if there's enough, Kana should drop into making shirts, which I have a feeling some of us are about to to uh, fall out of ours real soon. They're getting down to just tattered threads. You're handling a shroom torch. Now, why would you do that instead of continuing cooking? I don't know. Waiting for the last of this to hit, Kana's going to make some leather leggings, which is armor. If I can stall you off of that for just a moment till Simon finishes this and drops it on a shelf is 10 enough so you do that and then Kana undraft will you instead you won't so can I get you to make a shirt shirt not enough resources I'm guessing it needs 20 okay so you go ahead and do what you want yeah just well you did pick up the materials okay all right then so we're coming to the close of our the first day of this episode rita has been planting and planting and planting which is exactly what she needed i'm gonna let her go well into midnight she's still doing fine over here anybody else out anything else we need to do not really <clears throat> How close are you getting? 70%. Okay. 
So tomorrow, a bug attack. Hopefully. We'll see if we... Well, let me remember that. A bug nest attack. Assuming we don't get an actual bug attack instead. Card is playing the digger boy didgeridoo. That is that is a mouthful. <laughs> there he is. Edmund is something petting dog. Does dog want to be pet? He does not. He wants to sleep. Has the game figured out what to do when dog is sleeping? Uh, yep. He wakes up dog. Before they would just go into a loop. And not be able to do anything. So apparently with the update that has been fixed. Good. Simon is going to continue to make cloth. I guess until uh, until he collapses. Kana is transporting cloth. She's walking back. Oh. No, 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 no. Kana, stop. Okay. That's where all of our cloth went. Okay. Uh... All of you guys, let's floor. Flooring? What would that be? Construction sites. Uh, okay, so I canceled the flooring. Now, Kana, can you make me a shirt? How much cotton do we have now? Ah, uh, you're not there. Here? 20. 20 cloth. Let the game run a little bit. And now can you... There you go. I know you want to go to bed. But let's get that all gathered and loaded into the bench before you go to bed. So it won't be used for anything else. <clears throat> okay. And you're going to go find a little bit more. Simon's just gone to sleep. Everybody else out there is back home. Good. So... And you're putting this away. And you are tailoring. Good. We rotted feathers away. Darn. Okay. So, Kana, you can now go to sleep. Now that that's locked into the table. There we go. And I see your room is dark. Let's add a shroom torch to your room. Uh, can I do it because of the window? Yeah, okay. So we'll drop you in, I guess, there. And Paulette, you too. And these rooms are basically done. So let's go ahead and go there and there as well. Okay. So we'll use our shroom torches as both entertainment purposes and lighting. Discharging. What does discharging mean? What was the discharging? <clears throat> I don't know. I've never seen that word float up over the screen again, or like that. I have to rewatch that when I edit and see what was going on. All right, so two in the morning. Rita's still planting. Okay, Rita. Um, sorry. Come on back. Go to sleep. <laughs> uh, Simon, discharging. What is the discharging that's going on? All right, let's just stay here for a while while we're waiting for uh, uh, waiting for daytime to happen. Charging. Hmm. With each update, new things show up. Got to figure out what they mean. If I kick the speed up, it's probably going to go so fast that I won't see the source. Discharging. What is it? That's. It seems to be this one. So it has to do with the with this guy cycling. We're going downhill, we're going uphill. That's what it is. Each time he cycles, we're either going up or down. Okay, mystery solved. So let's speed you guys up, getting toward morning. Who's going to wake up first? Edmund is. So Edmund, what condition are you in? You're actually in pretty good shape. Constructing power poles. Actually, that would be nice. Yeah, we've got our lightning rod. Let's get it connected to the system before the next storm hits. And Carter's now going to be on construction first. Well, hunting first, then construction. Though he could use a real weapon, that's for sure. 
if we weren't going on the bug nest raid today, I'd say let's go do a bunch of scavenging since this is almost built. But I do want to get the carbon nanotubes into the system. Mostly, well, because of wanting to get this room done. But I've also noticed that we can't get to these guys, railgun snipers, until we have carbon nanotubes. So that is a thing. Um, but what should we throw in here? Let's throw in, oh, just to give him something to do in case he runs out of something. Let's go with these two. Just to get those researched. In fact, one of those, I don't know, I have a memory of getting some kind of a bonus. Let me think about that. Research. Um, is there anything about sped up research or, you know, 75% of it's already done? There's something in here. Seems like it was. Was it this guy? No? Hmm. Some little bonus, some little pop-up we got many, 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 many episodes ago. Yeah, we have poo riding in the in the the meadow out there. <clears throat> okay, so Kana is is that a t-shirt? You are making an unfinished shirt. All right, just just a shirt. Okay, because who is about to run out? Shirt, you're fine. Simon is okay. Khan is getting low, and Umair is getting low, so we need a couple of those in place. Uh, Simon, all right, let's, we're at 7 in the morning. Let's get everybody ready to go on a bug hunt. So, Carter just needs food. He likes bread. Does that exist? It does. Go do that one. Paulette, what is it? You just like smoking. That's right, I remember that. So, you need happiness. And that's pretty much it. And you're sitting. You're going to get plenty of happiness. Rita liked... Let's think about that. She liked meat pies. I don't know that meat pies are a thing yet. Are they? <clears throat> meat pies. You... Not enough resources. Let's move you up the list. Uh, something like that. But Rita, you need just food right now and to finish off your relaxation which is petting dog okay so when you're done go ahead and grab a looks like a grain porridge simon you need something you are eating already edmund you need food you are constructing poles when you get back grab i guess bush fruits that's what's left right now um kana same sort of thing. You're already eating, though. Umayar, you need to eat something, too. Grab some bread. Hey, just in time. Grab some bread. And, in fact, let's have you do that now rather than when you're done. There we go. You're going to research all day. That should bring everybody up to a pretty much full stat um, status. <laughs> to go on our, our bug nest raid. All right. While all that is happening, anything new pop out here besides more poo rotting away? Got birds over here. Got, ooh, got a hunting grounds over here. Got our small herd over here. You guys have been busy. Oh, hello. What happened here? And here. We've got birds. Boy, we do. Um, you, butcher. You, butcher. I don't know if we're going to get to these. But I'll at least mark them. Just in case we do. In fact, i got to make sure that Carter doesn't go running out there to do that. Just yet. Um, until everybody is done eating, which is probably this group right here. So with that, are we done? Uh, Carter claimed to be better at darts. Okay, stats, good. Uh, Paula could use a little something. What is she doing right now? She is cooking, and she's on her way to there. 
let's call you done. Unless there's someone else that's also in rough shape. Otherwise, I think we're finished. Okay, so let's grab everybody and head up the hill and do the bug hunt. We'll also get them maybe to hunt these guys and harvest these guys. Yeah, possibly even harvest some of these guys as well as butcher all of them. Let's grab everybody here. And set you guys to hunting. Alright, so we're almost in place. Um, let's go ahead and mark these guys. You are female, 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 female. That's the male. And the baby is a female. Let's take out all of the larger females on this, this small herd. Um, hunt you. Can I do that? I don't think I can. Oh, I can. Okay, good. So you guys are done, and we know we want to get these guys harvested. And <clears throat> let's leave it at that for now. Okay, so those are the immediate goals, as well as observing one of those nests up there. So you guys are kind of in place in a little bit of a firing line here. Kana, you can... Go there, and Rita, you are in range pretty much for this guy, right there. Let's lure them in. You took him out, and we've attracted everybody. We stirred up the nest. <laughs> Rita, you are there, so let you get another shot. Really? Oh, have I not marked them to hunt? Is that... I did. Yeah. Wait, something here wasn't. Oh, it was just the the gulch. Okay. All right. So why were you not firing then? I don't know. Let's back you up a little bit. Until you're ready to fire again, right there. You got a you got a target. Come on back a little further. They are on their way. Oh, you keep missing. Come on back a little further then. You you didn't come back. All right. You do that. Let's get everybody in range now. Now we can see what we're up against. Shoot, 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 shoot. Stunned. Good. Good. I think we can get one more round out of that. Maybe. Oh, you're getting close. Let's everybody go back. And another round. Boom, boom, boom. Let's do that again. Everybody fire. Got him. Good. Let's back up again and fire at this one. Good. Connor reached combat one. Great. So let's everybody go sideways while we can before we get backed up into the trees there. And what do we actually have going on? Uh, you guys are all down. So we have these three. And two more hatchlings somewhere. You guys are still up in here. Any of these that didn't get flagged? Hunt and hunt. Okay, anybody else I'm missing? What are you? Oh, you're just bug blood. <laughs> they're, they're Vulcan, apparently. All right, so you guys... Now, these guys will shoot from their tails when they get in range, and I have a feeling their range is pretty close to our range, so that actually worries me a bit. Let's go back a little bit further. I'd like to do this without any major injuries. We're a long way from a first aid kit. Rita... Take a shot and Paulette stun if you can. Good. Did you die or are you you dead? Okay. Or were you ready to attack? Um, let's see what happens here. When do you actually trigger to attack? And why is everybody else not shooting? It's like they didn't realize what was happening, huh? Too many deflecteds in there. Everybody, I think, got their shot off. Let's go back. Let's head for that hill. Whoa. Okay, let's... No, Rita, that is you, too. That is you. Okay, these guys are all down. Good. Rita, get a shot. Rita, get a shot. Rita! Okay, stunned and down. Okay. So you're next, or are you last? 
Uh, that's far enough. Get a shot. Good. Alright, who's left? We've got highlighted. You are sitting, you're sitting. We got one little one and two big ones. Am I getting that right? Yeah. I think that's all that's left. All of you guys come on back over here. Be easier to butcher them if they're all pretty much in the same area. Now Rita's range. Oh, they're all leaving. Okay. So let's kind of do that same thing again. Um, well, everybody here. But I wish there was a way to choose a, a pattern. What was that? Dungeon Siege, I remember, had that. You know, the pattern you want them to land on when you clicked right there and they all kind of dispersed into whatever. Was it Dungeon Siege? A long, long time ago. Anyway, Rita. Well, let's grab this back half and put you over here. Something like that. Okay, Rita. Let's go and say hi. Let's lure them down. Stay away from them, please. I don't want... There you go. I don't want to deal with two nests at once. Three of them are coming in. And another shot. Gotcha. You are there. We can get you a little bit closer. Oh, good. Three good shots in a row. One more time and we're pulling you out. Okay, come on back here. Let's let everybody else have a little bit of fun. Meanwhile, Rita, why don't you start over here? <clears throat> um, everybody else, thank you. Don't don't just ignore them. <laughs> I think we're done up there. I don't see any more wiggly blue things. So I think we're finished. So Rita and Edmund, why don't you go after that one? And Rita, you go after... Th no. Rita after that one. Okay. So, while they're going to hunt them, then Rita's going to harvest. Let's have Umayar undraft and go to the furthest nest away to observe from these guys. No mistakes, guys. We're only going to deal with one nest today. And let's see. Um, Paulette, undraft and take care of those four and this one. Carter, once you come over here, undraft and do both of those. Are you alive? No, you just fell standing up. Butcher you and butcher you. Okay, nobody else is further that way. The bug is not one of ours. All right. And this bug? No, just down there nesting. Okay. Um, how much poo is in this area? We could bring a whole bunch of that back if there's enough. Manure, 150. Ooh, okay. Um, who's in the worst shape? Who needs to go back first? You could collect poo and just leave. So, total happiness. Pullet's already low. Just Paulette. So, Paulette, why don't you instead haul manure? And that'll be your job. Haul that, get home, and be done. So, Edmund and Rita are chasing these guys. Edmund, why don't you go after this one? Rita's got that one kind of taken care of. All right, who's left? Kana. Undraft. Let's see if I can figure out which ones were Paulette's, and you can take all those. Something like that. And Edmund? No. Is that everyone? Simon. There we go. Undraft. And all of... Actually, you head up in here. I do have Simon, right? Yeah. You can butcher... Butcher... And we'll go with that. We'll see who finds something else or doesn't have something to do. Kana transporting, observing, butchering, and Edmund is just chasing that guy down. <laughs> okay. Uh, Rita, I have a feeling you're done. Where are you? You are just standing there. If I undraft you, I could tell you to hunt and 
front. And that's it. Okay, the other one did go down. Yeah. So you need to be butchered. And butchered, yeah. Okay. So we'll bring all the meat home, the hides home. Uh, let's see. Let's let Rita get one more down there. Can Edmund do the rest of these? He might be able to. I want Rita to start harvesting. And she's got the best harvesting skills. So Rita, why don't you begin harvesting the skin barks there. And Edmund, try not to uh, get these guys too angry at you. Butchering, butchering, transporting. She's going to be heading home. She's just in a low. I think she'll make it. And Edmund, there you are. You undraft and... Waiting for that to go away. You went directly to hunting, and yeah, you got angry. Okay, so Rita, can you hunt? Edmund, can you leave? <laughs> there we go. Keep going. Keep going. Rita, take him out. There you go. Okay, Edmund. You get to butcher and... Butcher. I feel like I'm missing one. One of you guys. Okay. And Butcher. And Butcher. There you are. And then you're going to Butcher this one. Okay, that's your job. Paulette is on her way home, and that's good enough. Okay. Harvesting, Butchering. Khan is Butchering. Observing. And Simon is already transporting. And he's going home. Um, Simon, can I get you to transport this way? Boy, you're so far away now, probably not going to get that 30 meat. Simon, how you doing? You happiness? You're still in a good mood. Um, let's get you to butcher this one. And boy, I wish I could get you to actually haul the meat... Let's see if I can play with this a little bit. If you were to pick that up, and then I were to tell you to haul... Oh, you're already transporting, so there isn't any meat. Really? Nothing? If I could click on another... If I tell you to haul, will you bring the 30 you have in your hand, or will you drop it? You're ignoring me completely. Let's try that again. Okay, there you are. So, haul. Transport. Transport and one more. Where are you at now? You're just flat out ignoring me, aren't you? Okay, fine. Leave you alone. I'm, I'm losing the battle anyway. Alright, so, Kana is tailoring. Um, no. You're going to butcher. And you're going to butcher. <laughs> oh, these are strong-willed characters here. All right, Evan is butchering, Har Rita is harvesting, Carter is clearing a construction site. You can get over here and butcher. And we'll see what to do with you after that. Umayar is still up there observing, and he is doing fine. Kana is butchering, Rita is harvesting, Paulette is just still leaving, and so is Simon. Okay. I feel like we're missing somebody. Paulette, Rita, Simon, Edmund, Kana. Alright, we'll get rid of you guys. You keep flagging me. Who am I missing? Kana, Rita, Carter, Edmund. Where's Edmund? He's right here. Paulette's leaving, Simon's leaving. Yeah, it still feels like there's somebody not in that list, but... Okay, so you are transporting 180, and you're calling it quits. Edmund, let's get you to Butcher there, and you can come back and grab these two afterward. Carter, let's see if we can get you to bring the meat most of the way, then go back and get the, uh, uh, the leather. Rita's leaving, and that's fine. Kana hopefully is going to get the command to pick up all of the loose little bug meats in the area before she heads home. 
Carter, you bring that over here and drop off. And then you come up and get the leather and drop off. We'll see if we can somehow group all this together. That's as close as you're going to get. Edmund is transporting. Let's see how close we can get you guys together. That is leather there. Okay, so of Carter, happiness good. Edmund, happiness is low. Okay, so Edmund, you're going to stop right there. I don't think I'm going to get you guys into this. I'm going to have to send somebody else back for the leather. I think so. So, meat's coming back. The skin bark's coming back. Kana is transporting so far just three. Hopefully that continues. Kana's health low. We'll see how far she gets. Tell me you are. Yeah, you are collecting. Good. <clears throat> so where is more? Uh, let's do this. And raw meat. There's some meat back in there. We have to come back and get that tomorrow as well. So you get what you can. There's some more over here. And the local wildlife will probably eat. And she's playing darts. She lost it. Can we do this again? I don't know. They're... Oh, now she's really going to be disappointed. Isn't she? Yeah. She's going to get another negative six and it's dark. Oh, man. So anybody else just drop their stuff? No, you guys are still doing your thing. Paulette is getting there. Simon is getting there. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And Umayar, how you doing? You're still fine. So I think you can finish this thing. I think so. Good. So you went back for more. You've got 66 now. And there's no more in there. There's no more there. There was a 15, there's a 5 over here. Uh, further up the hill, it's just a 5. That's it, so we lost 5 meat. I'll take it. Now, as long as you don't go and play darts and just drop everything again. And we'll see, it's a long walk in. We've got leather out here still. And I thought, whoa, what did I just see there in blue? Well, that's bushberry, beefberry, okay. I thought Umar was going to have to come back for another trip. But I think he's got this. So we'll just come back for another trip of nest formation of uh, leather or hides next time. Uh, part of an insect nest is formation is made of material that is the same properties as carbon nanotubes. So can I set you up to mine? Ha ha ha, there it is. But how close dare we get before we get into these guys? And do these ever respawn? That I don't know. Okay. So we'll set this group up to mine. Is that considered one? That's considered four. We'll do all of that. So we have nine mining areas. We need to come back soon and finish off these guys. Then we'll mark everything to mine. Otherwise, we've got leather to come back for over here. And I guess I can let this run now. Is there still leather out over... Where was the, the big hunt the other day? Here. Did we ever get back into this? I don't remember. Hides. So yeah, we've got hides to get in here. We have a lot of hides to pick up. There's probably more over here. Okay, risk of meltdown Edmund. Edmund is where right now? He's heading in. Okay. Did we ever empty this? We did not. So... That has taken a long time to happen, isn't it? Yeah. Oh well. We've got... Temperatures of 29. Fuel in this guy? Nah, we're still pretty good, considering we're not running but just once in a while through the night. Okay. So we are below freezing. The meat can be dropped off in here. Simon made it back because he's got the fastest run speed, so he got back before everybody. Oh, Paulette got back too. Paulette um, is in decent shape. We'll see how they go through the night. There's only one in the morning. Okay, yeah. So, these guys have made it, and they're going to be fine. Kana is still hauling her bug meat. She's here somewhere. There she is. And I saw a name over here somewhere. Where was that? Umayar. There you are. 
you have dropped... Oh, you never picked anything up. That's right. Too bad I couldn't have had you do one round of mining. Yeah. Now, you are not injured, and you are not injured. So you two will be the new herd up in here. What was that? Oh, just background. Okay. All right. Well, I'd say that went pretty successfully. We've got our initial research done. So next time we can go up and do some mining, pick up the leathers, and finish off this guy right here. Give everybody their own rooms just in time to find an eighth person. Now, um, risk of meltdown. So no more risks of meltdown. Just Kana now. And she's just arriving. Where is a Kana? I don't see a K anywhere on the screen. Where are you at right now? You are... St oh, yeah, that's right. You were up there with Omar. Okay. So you are the only one that might lose it tonight. It's possible. Um, otherwise, I'm sure we are ready for our next bug attack. That could happen at any moment. So... I think I will call it good right here. We're back, for the most part. And we accomplished the goals and... And I think I'm going to call this one finished. So I'll clean up all the last little details and get us ready for whatever adventure is in store for us next time. So talk to you later, folks. Bye-bye.